Hi everyone, it is September 3rd, 2017 and this is my mailbox. And yes, it does have a lamp on top. The lamp is for a demonstration to show my new contraption which lets me know when the mailman has been and delivered mail as my house is about 150 feet away and it sucks when it's raining or very very cold. So, as a demonstration, there's a the lamp at the moment it is off and I'm going to open it as if the mailman is delivering the mail and leaving and as you can see it's not very bright with the sun but the lamp changed to green to let me know that mail has been delivered. One thing I don't like, I must say, is this lamp uses a Zigbee bulb and I do not like them. Like I said, it's about 150 feet from my house so it is pushing the range. And that is an issue. The issue is, sometimes the mailbox will send commands to let the light know to change. But for some reason the lamp doesn't receive them, even when it's very close. So, I'm going to be changing that to a Z-Wave bulb. The system works with a simple re-switch and a magnet and the tails of that re-switch come down the side go under some tape and then out through the bottom right there then on the back of the mailbox what I have is a go control window contact sensor originally I did try to use the external import of the sensor well, for some reason, smart things did not want to reliably detect it every time. So what I ended up doing was desoldering the magnetic reed sensor, which is normally around here, and then cutting a couple of traces on the circuit board, adding a couple of jumpers to the screw terminal, which is at the top. So now the cable from the reed switch is actually joined in here, and then, like I said, just goes direct to those screw terminals. So if I want to do anything with that mail, not that sensor, then it's easy to add and remove. The tamper switch is still being detected on this, so if someone played with it, I would know. And this works fine. My house is about 150 feet away, and it transmits the signals perfectly fine. 